We're going to talk about uh, witchcraft here a minute, and what I know is only what the Lord has shown me and told me. We were walking around the jail cells that were 17 miles high, and there was a, to my surprise, there was a rocking chair inside this jail cell. And there was a skeleton sitting in here with an old little ragged doll, rocking back and forth, screaming and crying. And Jesus said, she's in great torture and great pain. And he said, I'm going to allow you to see uh, what she was before this happened and what she did. He said she was a soothsayer for Satan. And this woman is rocking, and all at once her appearance begins to change. Her whole countenance changes. So at first, she had on a beautiful dress. Let me see the dress of a, a, a beautiful woman. Then it changed to another thing. I think she changed into a uh, animal looking thing too one time. And in my book I talk about it, but she had many forms. And every time that happened to her, she would scream. And Jesus said, she got this power from the devil by killing people. She would get more power, they would drink the blood, and she would get all this power where she could do these things. And he said, uh, she was killed one day, and she came here, and Satan let her be tormented like this over and over and over. And it is a uh, drastic change, and she feels it, and she screams in pain, and this happens to her all the time. And she looked at Jesus, and she said, can't you help me? Can't you help me? And she reached to the bars and her, it was like flesh had burned into skeletons. And my heart went out to her and I tell this in many places and I don't know if it's Spanish, I forget the nationality, she said there truly is a woman of witchcraft in their circles that sits in a rocking chair and works spells and curses and hexes on people. And they, they said it's real. 